Kistara, let's talk for a bit. <sighs> Thinking some more about how to realize your ideals? <sighs> no. Actually, I've been trying not to obsess about it as much as before. I find when I think too much about my ideals, I get hung up on the reality of things and lose sight of what's really important. I know what it's like to go hungry. To lose your family. That should be reason enough to fight for a better society, so nobody else has to. <laughs> Sorry about that. Even thinking about things will make you hungry after a while. You wait here. I'll go whip something up for you. Thanks for the food. <laughs> What's so funny? Nothing. Just impressed at how good of a cook you've become. Well, we've been on this journey for a while now, so I've had more than a few opportunities to hone my skills. Yeah, and now I have a good meal in me. There's a simple kind of happiness that comes with that, you know? One that's more powerful and convincing than complicated logic can be. That reminds me of something Law said, about how talking too much doesn't put food in people's stomachs. That sounds like Law. <laughs> but it's true nonetheless. When you get down to it, all you really need is enough food to keep you full and to be surrounded by people you love. Everything else comes second. Speaking of people you love, I haven't heard you talk about Magal much lately. Hmm. <laughs> Wow, okay. Way to make me feel like the worst sister ever. But, you're right. I haven't. If I'm honest, I think it's because I finally found other people I love just as much. Whatever kind of society we end up having after this, it needs to be a place where I know you all can be happy. That's my starting point for now. Don't worry. Once I finish folding these clothes, I'll go to sleep. Rise and shine! We're almost ready to leave. <laughs> 